see. I'm going to be quieted down quite a bit. Hmm. Get quite a few visitors up this way. Satan. Satan? Satan's here? That's not good. The only thing to do that dude. Facts. Facts. change it to a different sound won't get these different voices unfortunately Satan and facts huh so you're telling me it's a fact he's here it's not the alien that was buried over there is it I hope not I think he ain't buried hmm. 91 years of age almost 90 actually Anybody else want to talk to us? Come on now, don't get shy. Bench. Bench. We are being benched. Thank you very little. I always like these old rural cemeteries. Oh, peace and quiet too. Eighteen thirty-five, eighteen eighty-seven, fifty-two years of age. We're almost fifty-two, fifty-one. Too late to August. You've been fifty-two. Son, twenty-two years of age. Anybody else here talking to me? I just got quiet all of a sudden. I guess this marker is completely broke. Got the quiet part. Everybody suddenly got quiet on me. That's not cool. Come on now. Talk to me. Maybe if my sister's here with me, she can talk to you guys to let you know. Chairs. Chairs. Bench and chairs. I'm not sure how to put that together myself. Over here. Hmm, almost made to 79. Eighteen ninety-nine to nineteen hundred. My gosh, thirteen months. Our baby has gone to her giver. Her body lies in the cold earth. That is really, I don't know, losing a child, I can't even imagine. I had enough trouble losing my brother and then my sister a couple years ago. I'm from the 1800s. You're from the 1800s? What, how are you doing? Thank you for talking with me. This is Mr. Mr. Oates I'm talking with, private colonel, private company D1 Development. I don't know what that means. World War One. Thank you for your service, sir. Are you here, Mr. Oates? Would you like to speak with us? You said you're from the 1800s, that's true. Grover Oates, 1884 to 1839. Hmm. 55 years of age. That's young, just by my standards. That's when you get old. 55 is young. You get up in your 60s, it's like, woo! This old boy died almost the same time I was born. The person I'm talking to from the 1800s, you, uh, you can speak. You need a little energy, energy just bring the battery out of my spirit box. Who's that? Not my camera, not me. I did that one time, so I'm just using my energy. That was a bad idea, dude. I won't do that again. got through I thought I was gonna die chest pains and stuff my wife gave me an aspirin real quick 
Had to settle down. I'm not doing that game. Loop, 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 loop. My sister here to help me, Lynn. You here to help me? Yes, I did. You did help me? Well, I appreciate it. Could you tell me some more? You know, tell the spirits I'm nice and uh, I'm here just for to learn from them as much as I can about what it's like on the other side. I really like to speak to somebody to tell me what it's like on the other side. Now, my brother, when he came to me on a visitation, he told me that I asked him what heaven was like. And he told me that heaven was like going to the beach every day and not worrying about suntan lotion. And for people who don't know what visitations are, they come to you it's like a dream but you know it's not a dream but i guess it'd be similar to a lucid dream you know you're dreaming but i knew i was making contact i got that from my grandmother she had that she used to do tarot cards and crystal ball i learned a lot from my grandmother I lived with her in a pretty rough neighborhood song in the ghetto by Elvis that's where I was at in the ghetto <laughs> let me see over here Horace Ford I had an uncle's last name was Ford my goodness he lived a few months poor child he was in war my uncle was in I'm war I'm very with lonely him. here you're very lonely here and there's nobody else to speak with or y'all just can't see each other or realize each other what's it like where you're at can you tell me what it's like where you're at it's dark blind. You're like blind really huh never thought about that so you're kind of like can't see anything and then there's no actual contact because you're not in physical form you're in spirit form There's nobody to talk to, we can talk. I'll be more than happy, we can talk. What would you like to talk about? What was it like when you were alive? What was your name? My sister's here, can you help this lady? I don't wanna run your energy low. My sister, I don't know either of you actually. Nobody. If you can't talk, you can't talk. My name is Anna. Anna. Well, hello, Anna. My name's Don. Good speaking with you. Uh, you said you were from the 1800s. What did you? What did you die of? How old were you? You remember? Can you remember things like that? Am I going too far away from you? So you can't speak? So I can turn around and go back to where I was at. If that helps. You still here, Anna? What did you die of? Or how old were you when you passed? Say it's like being blind where you're at. Thompson. Thompson? Anna Thompson? Okay, I'll have to look that up. See what I can find out. I don't see your marker. I haven't come across it, but I'll look for it. How do you feel where you're at? I know you said you were lonely. Can you kind of help me find your marker, Anna? You 
when you have no contact with your family who's passed? Am I getting close to your marker, Anna? Still looking for Anna Thompson. Skinwalkers around. Skinwalkers around, seriously? I'm looking, but I'm not seeing. But thank you. I'll be on alert for that. You still with me, Anna? Am I walking further away from your marker? Or am I getting closer? Skinwalker, what about the alien? You know anything about the alien, alien, alien that was buried here back in 1897? You can talk to me, Anna. It's very nasty here. Very nasty here, really? I hate to hear that. I thought it'd be nice. Am I getting close to your marker, Anna? I'm looking, but I'm not finding an Anna Thompson. Arm. You hurt your arm? Is that what caused you to pass? What, did you bleed out or something like that? Just lost a lot of blood? Many something. 1906, 1906. Small child. I had an injury. You had an injury? And on your arm? Was it a cut? Or did you lose your arm? Was it like a farming accident or something? Or did someone hurt you? Hide. So you hid. Or are you telling me to hide? I'm looking. There's a skinwalker around. He's very translucent. Suffered. You suffered? Yes. So someone, someone did hurt you. Who hurt you, Anna? Do you know the person who hurt you? The name of the person? It's kind of a cool day out here. Tomorrow we're supposed to get an Arctic blast. Down in the teens. Texas, we don't get that too often. Let's see Watkins. Am I getting close to your grave, Anna? Can you tell me more, Anna? Am I too far away? Neil Susan Susan some, somebody can make that out. 1940s. 1940s? So you died in the 40s? Last name here is Neil. I'm going to have to stop here in a little bit, Anna. I want you to know I really, really appreciate you just talking with me. I'm sorry about what happened to you. I just hope the person who did it to you that you got justice for what they did. That was wrong.
I'm sorry you're in a bad place and it's nasty where you're at. And it's lonely. That's sad. How old were you when you died in Anna? Can you remember that? You said you died in the 40s and you were born in the 80s. Still not seeing no Thompsons. Anna Thompson. I will look that up. I most, most definitely will. I hope you get better. I hope you find some company too, Anna. Because from what I've heard about heaven, uh, it's supposed to be a nice place, and apparently you're in a dark place. Can't be because I died in a sword fight. You died in a sword fight? Or y'all playing around? What was that? Make, what the world? That makes no sense. So you were y'all were just playing around in a sword fight, or and they cut your arm? Jeez Louise! So you bled out. So it was more of a just a. Were y'all fighting for real or just play fighting? I'm still looking, Anna. Looking for Anna Thompson. Bond. James Bond. I'm not making no fun, Anna. I'm sorry. Don't mean no disrespect. Yet. Anna, I appreciate you speaking with me, but I think I'm going to be bringing this video to an end. Look around a little bit more. If I do find Anna Thompson's marker, I will show it to you. Appreciate everybody watching. You know, we're a new channel. We're still learning. Any comments, any suggestions to make it better, I sincerely appreciate it. Constructive or not, I can deal with it. I'm old. You know, management. Stink. Stink, I stink. Took a shower this morning. All it stinks are is I stink because I'm fixing to cut off. I don't mean Anna, but goodness gracious. I'm going to cut it, Anna. You have a good day, Anna. Everybody else? Appreciate you subscribing and sharing. Thanks.